go day divers. My first time here diving, and I have to say, what a beaty, a beautiful place to be. This place looks very promising. Just have to survive my way out to the water. We have currents in the water, several bridge pillars to dive down along. Plus, according to sources, a high chance of finding fish. As you see here, it was fish as promised. Cod and pollock, plenty of them. So, needless to say, we are pretty stoked about this place. We got about four, eight meter visibility in the water, which is pretty good considering that we are in the middle of May and about eight degrees in the water. And there is boat traffic here. So that's something we have to take into account while we're here. We have about five hours in the water at our disposal and my dive buddy out there has already fish on. So let's dive into it. On my way over to the next pillar, I notice a lot of activity below me, both small and slightly larger fish, just cruising around right below me, directly above the seabed. I see a nice fish, a nice cod. I'm right behind a pillar now, but I need to locate the boat that is in motion. Then I go down and take the shot. I see that the boat is no threat to me. There it goes. A fish is coming toward me. It is curious, so I let it come to me, waiting for the shot until it turns on its side toward me. Then I shoot. At least that is the preliminary plan. When it turns and all I need to do is pull the trigger, I hesitate for a second whether to take the shot or not. It was a miracle that the arrow went through. A millisecond slower there, the arrow had wandered past the fish. It was sheer luck that it was a hit. So, pretty lucky with that one. But I was glad it was a hit. This Pollock was turned into what we call 
Himalagda fiskakakar in Norwegian. In more familiar words, homemade fish cakes. It tasted absolutely lovely on the dinner table. The last pillar was very exciting. There was deeper water and bigger fish in the current. My buddy is already there. Let's check it out. That pillar was awesome to hunt around. Still decent fish to see, but we have pushed the big ones further out towards the middle. We retreat towards the first pillar to check out the conditions there before going ashore. Yeah. Briefly summarized, very cool place to hunt. We caught a lot of fish, observed even more. Lots of beautiful nature here and a very species rich yeah. place. We'll definitely come back here to explore more. Now the fish must be filleted and packed cold before we return home. Yeah. And so without further ado, Go day divers. 